Okay, good afternoon everyone. Um, I'd like to address the policing community, the Town of Orangeville staff, Town Council, fellow members of the Police Services Board, and fellow citizens. Um, I want to start my remarks by thanking the Orangeville Police Service for their tireless work they've done in supporting our community over the past century. Yeah. For sure. Sure. Uh, Chief Klinsky and his team have made a positive impact on Orangeville. I'm thankful for the community activism and contributions to the safety of our town. They will not be forgotten. There is no doubt that the policing process was divisive. A majority decision was made to make significant change. As such, I ask that all citizens work to make our new OPP service successful. Support them. Embrace them. Welcome them. I fully intend to do the same. I'd like to recognize my fellow town councillors. I have great respect for each of you and admire the courage you displayed as we collectively worked through, at times, a very daunting process. Thank you for your professionalism. As chair of the Police Services Board, I can tell you that all of us on the board are looking forward to working with the OPP, and especially Inspector Randall. My interactions with the OPP thus far have been warm, friendly, and most importantly, productive. I'd be remiss if I didn't mention the significant contributions made by police board members, Ken Craker, Mary Rose, Ian McSweeney, and of course, Mayor Brown. I know each of them are excited to create strong partnerships and work together on positive changes for Orangeville. Lastly, it was deeply satisfying to work closely with our town staff on this policing initiative. They're a strong group of excuse me, they're a strong group of professionals who earned our utmost respect. Welcome to Orangeville, Ontario Provincial Police. We're glad you're here. Thank you, everyone. Your Worship, do you mind pointing your feet straight towards the provincial police? The town of Orangeville played hard to get but you finally get to take her home from the dance. This courtship started in earnest during the lead up to the October 14, uh, 2014 municipal election. Now here we are six years later and looking forward to this new partnership with anticipation and absolute confidence in the decision. I want to thank members of our town staff who led the transition team, CAO Ed Brennan, General Manager of Community Services, Ray Osmond, General Manager of Corporate Services, Andrea McKinney, Town Treasurer Nandini Syed, Manager of IT Services Jason Hall, and Manager of Human Resources Jennifer Gone, and their support teams, who despite the unusual demanding circumstances of the pandemic and their regular workload, worked tirelessly over the past several months to ensure that every detail of the transition was taken care of and every OPS, OPS member was treated with respect. I also want to thank Police Service Board Chair Todd Taylor and PSB member Ian McSweeney for their guidance through the final CBA negotiations. Like Chair Taylor, I wish to thank every member of both civilian and uniformed members of the Orangeville Police Service and wish them the best as they embark on a new chapter in their lives. The town greatly appreciates their many years of dedicated service. To the OPP members who will be serving and protecting the residents of Orangeville, while former OPS officers embrace OPP culture and training during their experienced officer training program in Aurelia, welcome. We hope you enjoy your time in our great town. Police around the world have been under a great deal of stress and additional scrutiny over the past few months. Our town council, our police service board, and the residents of Orangeville have the utmost respect for all of our first responders. We wish to make the transition, amalgamation, and startup of policing under OPP leadership as seamless as possible. Once again, on behalf of the residents of Orangeville and the entire town council, Commissioner Karik and dedicated members of the Ontario Provincial Police, welcome to Orangeville. Commissioner Karik. Thank you very much, Your Worship. Chair Taylor, members of the Police Service Board, members of council for the town of Orangeville, and staff. 
thank you for the warm welcome to your town here today. We consider it an honor and a privilege that you have selected us as your police service to continue a strong tradition of community-minded policing that has been done so well by the Orangeville Police under the leadership of Chief Wayne Kalinske, who retires today after 41 years of dedicated service to his community. Yeah, thank you. I would also like to thank His Worship for recognizing the challenges that we face in policing today. So it is so important to have the support of the communities for which we are entrusted to serve and protect. Policing is about people, policing is about partnerships, and we only police with the consent of our communities to ensure that we are able to join the safest and most secure communities in this entire country. We look forward to partnering with you. We look forward to earning your trust and confidence. And we certainly look forward to being your police service. Welcome to all the members of the Orangeville Police Service who today join the ranks of the Ontario Provincial Police. Thank you, merci, make wedge.